hello in this video we will talk about uh, filtering operations uh, on image and particularly we will talk about how to apply a mean filter uh, on a particular grayscale image in MATLAB so open MATLAB in MATLAB first we will uh, read the image so we will take an image I am read and we will take an image which is by default already present in the MATLAB that is camera man dot tif camera man dot tif and let's see how the image look like so this is the uh, famous image and it is already present in the matlab as well so in this video we will uh, talk about the filtering operation using main filter uh, before applying the main filter first we will need to convert this image uh, into a double format if we look at the class of this image it is a unit 8 uh, type of a variable we need to convert it so we will convert it im to double img this command converts uh, this unit 8 uh, variable uh, into the double format and now we need to create a mask uh, uh, for the uh, image and uh, in the mean filter mask is by 3 by 3 divided by 9 so if we look at the variable f so it is a 0 0.11 by 9 values and uh, now simply uh, for filtering the image we will uh, uh, simple filter it by the filter command filter command in MATLAB use for one dimensional filter as we know the image is a 2d matrix of uh, numbers so for specifying it we need to write filter 2 for specifying that uh, it is a, a 2d filter operation and then and the mask value which mask uh, the mask uh, which we want to apply and the image and the image has been filtered now let's see how the image looks like uh, img1 so as you can see it is a blur a little bit blurred image and we will uh, discuss this operation in just a while before uh, it uh, lets close all other windows and uh, we will display both the images uh, on the same same figure so subplot 2 comma 1 comma 1 i am sure i am g this was the original image and then subplot 2 1 2 i am sure i am g 1 So if we look at carefully on these two images, this was the original and this was the filter one. And if we look at careful on this region, the edges has been blurred out. That means the uh, image has been smoothened uh, from the sharp edge, uh, from the sharp values. This uh, uh, this phenomena occurring because of the nature of the mean filter, as we know or if we go into the theory part of the mean filter we will find that it is a low pass filtering low pass filter so low pass filter means it will pass the lower frequency component in the image and will stop the higher uh, frequency components and, uh, and now the question is what are the higher frequency component in the image in image the edges where the values got to change all of a sudden that are considered as a higher frequencies component so when we apply a low pass filter it smoothens those particular components and it smoothens the edges of the image that's why our blurring operations takes effect in the original image so through this way we can easily apply any filter to the image using the simple filter to command and we can uh, produce uh, various interesting effects in the original image and we will uh, learn uh, about various other uh, this type of interesting 
uh, interesting uh, shades uh, in upcoming videos so that's it for this video thank you